Hey agents, this is John Fowler with Senior Enrollment Solutions. It is summertime leading into fall and there are tons of events going on. Not only through Oak Street Health, but through dedicated GenCare and other events and venues that are opening up as COVID begins to die down. Well, in this series, we're going to discuss how to get into an event. Well, you have two different options. Your first option is to go in and talk to the event coordinator or the front desk individual that manages that Section 8 housing skilled nursing facility or facility in which you're looking to get in to have an educational or semi-formal event. Your other option is to tag team. SES has many events scheduled this summer that we can invite you in to be part of an SES event or once again, dedicated GenCare and others are having additional events where we can plug you into those events also to be in front of your community. Now, once you're in front of the community, few things need to transpire. First, you're there to collect leads. This is a consent to contact form. You can click on the link below and we'll provide you consent to contact forms or you can always use specific carrier consent to contacts. However, if you're at an SES event, if you're at an event that's not a carrier event, you may wish to use a generic approved consent to contact. Well, basically this is nothing more than a lead card. You are collecting someone's information and they're providing consent to have you phone them to book an appointment or to help them telephonically at a later time to enroll in coverage. Collect as many of these as humanly possible at your event to have as many leads to follow up with afterwards, which will then create appointments, which will obviously then create sales. Now, while at the event, I have found that at events, there are many vendors and many booths passing away giveaways, trinkets and trash, if you will, to these consumers walking by the events or by the booths. How do you stand out as an individual? Well, you can provide someone either a business card which is going to get lost in their bag of goodies, or you can provide them a larger sheet of paper, obviously we call these Medi-Meds if you will, that provide your name, your phone number, as well as the benefits that you may be able to assist that consumer with. And then on the back side, we also provide the OTC benefits as just a generic OTC benefit that may enhance the consumer uh, in reaching out to you to obtain a specific benefit that they may need at that point in time. If you're having difficulty getting past the gatekeeper to schedule an event at a Section 8 facility, skilled nursing home or retirement community, you may wish to try and place an educational event where you're going in and just discussing Medicare 101 and not necessarily discussing a carrier as an informal event. Your gatekeeper may be more apt to opening the doors to someone who just wishes to do an educational event as opposed to come in and sell a specific carrier. Your other option may be to discuss with that event coordinator or gatekeeper why you should be coming into that location. What changes have occurred in that community? Is there a new plan that is opening the doors up in that county that may be a good fit for many of these consumers? If you have any additional questions or need additional assistance in getting past the gatekeeper to schedule an event, reach out to us at 248-270-9577. We will either go out with you or we'll make the phone calls to assist in getting you into that venue to be able to have either an educational, informal, or formal event.